Hello and welcome to another music lesson from Mark Music Studio. In today's lesson, we are going to be looking at chords and progression. Now, it's very important that when you are playing, you form your chords or basically you just make your voice in interesting. You want to change from that root position, using up your inversion just to you know change your overall sound you know you're making that transition from beginner intermediate slash advanced you know you want to change up your voicing so that you can have a different sound so today we're going to look at some chords and progression that you must learn in order to improve your playing let's dive right into it now the first progression that i want to be looking at i want to be looking at the seven three six five This is a very interesting progression. Um, as a gospel musician, I find this progression in, you know, I would say 80 to 90 percent of the songs I play, I find this progression somewhere in the song. So this is a progression that you want to learn. Let me play it one more time slowly. If you, if I'm going too fast, you can slowly tape down, look at it, practice it. If you're uh, beginner slash intermediate you know seeking to move on to advance these this is a progression that you need to learn seven three six five one four for the chord in seven i'm playing a c diminished seven that's a chord in seven okay so, for three, I'm playing a F sharp nine flat 13. Sharp nine. For my six, I'm playing an A sharp minor 11. For my chord in five, I'm playing a G minor seventh chord. sharp major seven all right so take note that's a this is a progression that you want to learn the seven three six five four right now on progression the two five one very important progression you want to learn this a lot of songs in this way it's a perfect cadence right so D minor 9 for 2, G sharp 7 flat 9 for my play on my 5, C sharp at 9 for 1 card. Very important progression. You want to hold on to that. Now, I call this the gospel walk. You need to learn this.